Hey doll, so I'm back with another unboxing video and this is what I have been wanting for like probably a few weeks now. It took me forever to get my hands on these dolls. So without further ado, let me go ahead and open up this Target package and make sure they're all inside. I'm back and as you can see I finally got my hands on the new deluxe fashionistas oh my goodness like y'all don't know how bad I wanted these dolls I just did the video where I was talking about my Barbie.com little doll haul and these two girls were completely sold out and they're still sold out and I believe one of them I believe she's still available for pre-order but one of them last time I checked was just not even available yet so I got these from Target.com I'm gonna show you at the end of this video how I purchased it even though it said that it's sold out okay so anyways oh my goodness I don't even know what to do I don't even know what to say I don't even know where to start I'm gonna show them to you close up but first I wanted to say they completely and totally met all of my expectations the girls look gorgeous I'm not disappointed at all or let down okay they look like I expected them to look and I want to tell you how much they were for the two for um Barbie fashionista boho curvy she was $14.99 um, for Barbie Fashionista the Sport, she was also $14.99. And I'm looking at my receipt, but it doesn't have the prices on here. So I want to say that this Fashionista was either $8.99 or $9.99. So originally when I was buying this set, the reason I went ahead, I was looking for these two. I'm not going to lie because I, I knew that Target had some of them, but they were sold out. So I ended up finding a little trick up to how I could get them, even though it said that they were sold out. And when I was ordering them, it wasn't enough for me to get free shipping and handling and honestly I hate paying shipping and handling so I was like I might as well get another doll to put me at the $35 range so that I'll get free shipping so I only pay like three dollars more than I would have paid if I had to pay shipping you see what I'm saying and I wanted to get my hands on this beauty so bad. So I'm so happy that I have her in my collection because I was originally going to get her from ToysRUs.com. So now I literally have all the fashionistas I want. Like there's not one fashionista in existence <laughs> that's breathing. Well, I don't know. <laughs> they might not be breathing unless they're breathing that plastic. But I have all of the fashionistas that I want until they come out with the new one. So without further ado, let me stop yippity yapping. Oh my goodness. Let me go ahead and show you these fashionistas. And oh, oh. Best believe we're going to open them up in this video. So before we open up our first girl, let's do a recap. Let's, you know, I love to look on the back of the box to see what we already got. So, of course, we got number 8, 64, 11, 60, 61, 12, 66, 10, 65, 62, 63, 7, 59. Okay, we got all these dolls. We're not even going to finish counting. The only ones that we don't have is number 67 and number 58 because I didn't want them. Those are the only ones in this collection that I don't have, okay? And then there's also another deluxe fashionista that I didn't get. But as soon as she's available in the store, I'm going to get her when I see her in the store. Anyways, ta-da! <laughs> oh my goodness, look at number 86. She is just super super cute okay and she definitely looks latina to me but she also looks like she could be like blazing you see what i'm saying black and asian type thing going on so i think this doll is gorgeous because i don't have any fashionistas that look like her she came flawless so i love it when they come flawless because I, i'm not even thinking about doing a repaint no 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 not unless i get another one of her then of course yeah i might do a repaint or something like that now she's so awesome that i'm definitely gonna put her on one of the made to move barbies that's why y'all see i loaded up on made to moves because i I'm not playing like I was waiting for him. So I don't know if this one, no, this is too light. Um, then we got this one, which that might be a match. And then we have the soccer Barbie, which is also like orange top. And I think this is going to be the perfect match right here. So I'm definitely going to be swapping her body out because I need this girl up in my doll life. Okay. Doll World Shows needs this girl up in their life. <laughs> so she's super cute. Definitely going to be a high school student. I can't wait to put her on the real Barbies of Atlanta. Y'all, I'm sorry for, for just yapping my mouth, but I, I really wanted this set so bad. Like y'all don't even know the half. Okay. <laughs> but anyways, let's see what they got inside. Oh, one distinction that I want to 
to make is that these boxes didn't come like how I expected them to come. You know how the other fashionistas that we opened up that were deluxe has like the big box with the double outfits and all that. I thought this was going to come like that, but they didn't. But anyways, let's look anyway, see what they got. She comes with a visor, a bag, a really cute dress, okay? And then she has this thing that's over, um... That, that was really separate when I saw it online. But um, this is her little jacket. I guess that's a raincoat. I don't know what she got going on. And then she has these Barbie shoes, which are one of my favorite Barbie sneakers. But I do have like three sets of these already. Okay, and then you can see the other girls in the set. I want both of these. Now, this girl's outfits were bomb. And I like her also, but I'm going to wait till these two come out in the store to go ahead and get them. Okay, so now it's time for the moment of truth. I'm going to go ahead and open her up so we can take a closer look at this Barbie fashionista. Okay, doll, so now we have number 86 out of the box. And as y'all can see, I did take off her coat because I wanted y'all to see her dress underneath. And it is, I want to show y'all the back. Okay, love her hair. Love the ponytail. I love her style, period. So I decided what she's going to be. She's going to be Latina, Asian, and Black. Okay, so she's <laughs> she has multi-ethnicities going on. Just, she just has to also be Latina, okay? But anyways, yes, I love this girl. Like, I, I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Like, she's probably one of my favorite fashionistas that I've gotten in a while. I must say that. I just love her outfit. I like this little type of, it looks like a sweater dress. Uh, I love the hoop earrings, okay? She reminds me of my other fashionista that I just got with the bun. So, y'all know I love those hoops, okay? <laughs> um, so, yeah. And then, for her additional outfit, she comes with this little raincoat thingy. <laughs> uh, they're trying to make sure she does not get wet out in the rain, okay? And it comes with a hoodie, actually. All right? And it seems like it has a little slit back here. I don't know if that's for her hair to come out. That's kind of weird. <laughs> Mattel, what is this for? <laughs> What's going on? But yeah, it has like this little slit also in the back. So that's one of her pieces. Then she comes with this super cute dress. This green dress is really sporty. And I knew it had a split on the side because this is just designed to have a split. So loving that. And then she has a cute little visor and a little bag that she comes with so this does come with accessories this doesn't come with as much as the other deluxe fashionistas like i said this was 14.99 so um it looks like they've cutting down a little bit <laughs> come on mattel stop skipping us mattel but um i'm still like really excited anyway because i just love how these dolls look okay and then like i said she has on the shoes that i already have probably about two or three pairs of these maybe four pairs of these already um but it's okay because i do love those and if i wanted to i could go ahead and start customizing them uh, or whatever or just make them like some <laughs> keep them like that and call them like some type of barbie sneakers up in dollywood so let me show y'all her close up check her face out it looks like she has a tiny a super tiny nick right here on her eyebrow but that's cool because i can just um colored that in that's not a huge deal it's, it's 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 okay i can take it her hair is super soft it doesn't have like it has a little bit of the glue stuff in it but it's still really soft nothing crazy i love the shape of her eyes i love the fact that she has beautiful brown eyes and then look at her lip color very nice pretty lipstick so this dog gets a hundred from me very happy to have her um she she's gonna definitely be a senior in high school because she's she's ready to go to college you feel me and she already has a boyfriend i'm not even gonna tell y'all who her boyfriend is i was decided between two dolls what i wanted to be his girlfriend um so she won <laughs> so anyways just stay tuned y'all i swear like real barbers of atlanta's about to get turned up because i got a week and a half left this semester and it's about to get real okay so at any rate, y'all know how I do. I like to go ahead and get them all dressed up in their outfits to show you how it looks. So we're going to put her in her other outfit and we'll be right back. Okay, 
doll. So now I have her in her second outfit. And I also absolutely love this outfit as well. As you can see, I put her a visor on. I didn't put it on all the way, though. I just sat it on top of her head. Then I have her with her um white clutch in the, with this outfit. It goes well with her sneakers. And I wanted to give y'all a close-up of the clutch so that y'all can kind of see the detailing on it. So it looks like it has like a little zipper, you know, and then it has some embroidery going on. So yes, I absolutely love this dress. I just think it's cute. I would wear something like this in real life. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what can I say? And then I love the split. I'm big on splits. I have a whole bunch of skirts with splits just like that. So yes i love this whole look i would wear this this complete outfit because i told you i was a hill girl like all through high school but now i'm starting to really get into flats and i'm actually starting to collect tennis shoes which was something i haven't done since i was like in middle school in middle school and in ninth grade i had like all the tennis shoes so i just started kind of started collecting jordans again and different things that i like like vans and all kind of stuff so yeah i i love it i think this is really really cute i'm just so happy about this doll y'all know this is nothing like the disappointment that i got from toys r us the other day all of these dolls all three of them are like on fleek right now so i'm gonna put her to the side and we're gonna open up our next deluxe oh, right. fashion so now we got number 85 and she has a very different look um she has freckles it looks like she has gray bluish eyes she kind of has the eye color that i just gave um Tay, the doll that I did a custom on, the Musician Barbie, that was like kind of the same eye color that I was going for. So I would say that she has like a bluish gray. I do like her freckles. Her They have her freckles popping though. <laughs> her freckles are really popping. Then she comes with like this little head wrap. And it looks like a little purse is in there as well as a dress. And then let's see her shoes. And her shoes are good because I don't have those shoes yet. And I do think that this little yellow dress is really cute. I could see one of my other Barbies, especially Destiny in this dress, going to church. Like, Destiny would wear this dress to church. Not Destiny, but the Denise. <laughs> so, oh, and then it looks like she has two accessories going on around her neck. Is that either, I don't know if that's an accessory or that's like to keep her in the box. But it looks like she has a choker on and then it looks like she has this little um kind of rope necklace so that's cool i'm big on chokers i didn't i used to wear chokers all the time in elementary but now that i'm older i do have like some really nice chokers and i just got a really really nice choker that um one of my clients sent me that i love okay so yeah i i like this um this set a lot so without further ado let's go ahead and open up number 85 so we can get a better look Okay, doll, so very, very extremely happy, pleased, satisfied with her. She's really cute. When I took her out the box, like, I loved her a lot more. <laughs> like I said, I don't know what it is about taking some of these girls up out the box. But let me go ahead and show you her up close. So, as you can see, like I said, her freckles, um, I like her lipstick that it's like a nice neutral color, but still a little bit of pop of color. That's how I like to do my personal lipstick. I don't really do bright colors much. Every now and then I might do a red for like a special video or something, but that's it. This is a choker, and I want to turn it around because y'all can see it does snap on and off. So, this is super cute. I love this because not only can I use it with her, but I can use it with some of my other dolls. And then, again, she has this rope necklace on that I just think is so pretty i love this dress um this dress is super cute okay so let me show you the back of the dress oh check that out i love the back all right <clears throat> her shoes and her hair is really pretty i like her hair it is a little bit of gel you know like jelly feeling to it but it's it's good it doesn't look like too matted or anything so i'm happy about that and it does look like they tried to give her some braids on the side <laughs> so she does have little braids that are on on her box and let me show you as well what other outfit she comes with so 
she has this outfit that's like a romper okay and then like i told you she has this little head wrap okay and then she has this bag which i already have this bag um either in this color as well as some other colors i got this bag a lot so yeah um but yeah let me know what y'all think about her let me know what y'all think about both of these dolls and also let me know what you think do you think that it's worth it that mattel has kind of doubled down on the the luxe fashionistas because they used to come with like two outfits two pairs of shoes and then they would come with like two bags you know and probably another accessory so it seems like they've kind of doubled down on them but at the same time they are making like dolls that are even more unique so y'all let me know what y'all think about it if it's worth it but anyways let me go ahead and get her changed into her other outfit all right so now that we got her in her second outfit i must say that i'm absolutely in love with this i actually it's weird because i really love this dress and i think it's just classy but i see this dress more on some of my other dolls um with other complexions to me this outfit brings out the personality of this doll more just because it's like individual you won't see too many people walking around in an outfit that looks like this um but i love it and i already know like when i put this outfit on her i was like okay i already know who her best friend is going to be on the real barbies of atlanta okay this is going to be a real one right here a high positive high vibrating girl so her best friend is going to be the same way so any of y'all who are familiar with the characters you might be able to guess who her her best friend might be but um yes i love her in this dress let me show y'all her close up with it as you can see i did pair it with her little bag but i'm gonna put that to the side for right now and the dress has like a little you know floral pattern going on um of course she still has the, the her shoes on and then she has this little head wrap that i really like and i just slid it on her head so that's how it looks okay so yeah i'm really satisfied with this doll she's not gonna be a teenager by the way i know i've been making like a lot of my hey my new dolls um high school students because i'm about i'm telling y'all the class is about to get turned up like y'all about to get into the lives of the students also on the real barbies of atlanta i've just been working on the classroom sets but those are going to be done soon so it's going to be a whole nother aspect to the real barbies of atlanta coming up that I can't wait to do, okay? But, um, yeah, I don't know what I want her name to be. Her name looks like it should be, like, Genevieve. Something different like that. I might name her Genevieve or, um, I don't know. Gina. No, I think Genevieve. I don't know. I don't even know anybody with the name Genevieve. So, I'm just gonna say that she named herself, okay? Because <laughs> I'm feeling Genevieve for her. But anyways, y'all let me know what y'all think about this one. So that's it for these videos. I'm super happy to have both of these girls in my collection. Y'all don't even know. I was having cold sweats at night. I was having nightmares. Couldn't sleep. <laughs> Trying to figure out how to get these dolls. <laughs> Okay, I might exaggerate a little bit, but no, for real, I was really going through, like, anxiety trying to get these dolls. So, I have a part two. It's going to be a really quick video, probably going to be, like, a three or five minute video. I'm going to show you on my computer from my computer screen how I went ahead and got them because I couldn't find them on Amazon, couldn't find them on Walmart.com, almost couldn't find them on Target.com, Barbie.com had them sold out. So, it was, I went to the stores, I called different stores in my area, and nobody had these dolls, so, yeah, I went through trouble trying to get them but i'm happy that i did because to me they're very worth it now i didn't forget about this beauty like do not be sleep the reason i didn't open uh, my petite fashionista she's called blue brocade the reason i didn't open her in this video is because i have other fashionistas and i'm gonna open her with those fashionistas because i still have like um a whole bunch of fashionistas to open that I need to so I was waiting on her that's who I was waiting on before I opened all of these I was waiting on her before I opened all of these so that you can see I have these are going to be like probably these are my last four fashionistas from the older fashionistas that I wanted to get now I pretty much have like 
really all the fashionistas that I wanted. Um, so I'm pretty caught up. I know I've been going in on the toys lately, but that's because I was off of my game for like four months. I was really busy with business and school and like my other channels because I do have other channels that are popping, y'all. Don't get it twisted. If y'all like nail stuff, check out K Diamond. If you're into spirituality, check out Pretty Boss TV. It's popping over there. I just reached like 12,000 subscribers and climbing over there. Like Pretty Boss TV is growing quickly. So, um, and then I just have other random channels. I have a natural hair channel, back to natural, and like 10 other channels. <laughs> like, no lie. So, um, yeah, that's why I was um kind of that's why I wasn't able to do my doll videos. I just had a lot going on, especially with school. Um, um, but I'm going to open these girls in another video all together. I'm going to open them all at once. And uh, I can't wait to do that. Like, after I edit this video that I just did and post it, I'm going to go ahead and do the unboxing for these girls and get them open. Because I cannot wait to open them. Like, oh my gosh, she is so gorgeous in person. I, let me just show you her because I don't think I showed y'all a close-up of her on this video. Um, even though I'm going to do another video. But check her out. Oh my gosh, yes. Like, yes gorge so and her hair is popping so yeah but anyways dolls i hope that you enjoyed this video as i said stay tuned for part two because i'm gonna do a quick tutorial on how i went ahead and ordered them even though it said that they're sold out i found a glitch in the system <laughs> but um let me know what y'all think about these girls also let me know if you found them in your local target because so far the only people that i've seen that found them on instagram i believe they got them from target or they ordered them directly from barbie.com when it was still in the pre-order um time where you could pre-order also i do think that one of these dolls i can't remember which one i want to say that it's the boho one i think that you can pre-order her but she's not going to be available until october 13th last time i checked and she might be sold out but it could be reversed i don't know which one it's just one of them were still sold out and they were like okay we'll send you notifications when she's available and then one of them was available for pre-order but they're not going to be able to start shipping out until the 13th so anyways like i said i hope that you all enjoyed this video um make sure that you subscribe if you like the video make sure you hit the like button you know it doesn't hurt <laughs> it does not hurt to hit that like button with that thumb and it definitely doesn't hurt to comment I really appreciate all of my subscribers who comment on my videos. I got it. I have to give like a plethora of shout outs. Um, I really do. One shout out that I have to give is to Minka Gaston. Like, I love you. <laughs> I love you. Like, I love your comments. I really appreciate your input on my videos. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I'm pretty sure you're going to check out this video. That's why I had to give you a shout out. Minka Gaston, y'all. And I'm going to be giving you like a whole bunch of random shout outs. I'm also going to be doing a giveaway, a pop-up giveaway for this holiday month. And I'm just going to choose. I'm not. It's not even going to be something that you can enter. I'm just literally going to choose like five subscribers who really rock with my channel and give away stuff. So, hint, hint. But anyways... Let me know what y'all think about this. I love y'all. I didn't want to make this too long. I'm just super, I'm, I'm lit, y'all. <laughs> anyways, I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.